So when your plants get pretty big, these are actually maybe a little too big <laughs> in your propagation trays, you're going to move them to your regular plant trays. There's two reasons why we don't plant them directly into the plant trays. One of them is just for space and for the fact that we can raise a lot more plants by having these stay in smaller trays to start. The second reason is the plants don't demand quite as much nutrient when they're smaller and so by moving, keeping them smaller like that and then moving them to a larger tray, we're going to allow them that extra growth that they need at that final stage. So a lot of it's just about space saving, but all you're going to do to move or plant your garden is simply fill this up with nutrient and you're going to take these out of the propagation and stick them right into this tray here. And then again, you'll put these on the bottom four shelves and you'll alternate the holes. And that's how you'll plant your whole system out. You can do that on the same day that you plant new seedlings if you want. So you will move the big plants out of the top of the garden into the bottom and then you can start new seedlings. And that will keep your cycle of growing going.